Absolutely. You can dive into House of the Dragon, even if you've only braved two winters in the Game of Thrones series. Here's why. Background isn't everything. House of the Dragon is more of a prequel than a sequel. It's set nearly 200 years before the events with which you're mildly acquainted. This means you'll be witnessing the Targaryen Civil War, also known as the Dance of the Dragons, and not the winter that Ned Stark always fretted about. Understanding the context of Game of Thrones enhances the experience, sure. It's like walking through Portland's Japanese garden when you know a bit about the Heian period. You get that deeper sense of immersion. But it's not necessary. You can appreciate the beauty and serenity of the garden without it, just as you can enjoy the political backstabbing and dragon drama on its own merits. Fresh Faces, Same Shaky Thrones The series has a completely new ensemble, which means you won't be struggling to remember the fates and fortunes of the characters you might have briefly met. There's no need to recall who betrayed whom at King's Landing, or who's plotting revenge from the shadows. You've got new players vying for the Iron Throne. Sure, knowing the ultimate fate of the Targaryens adds a level of dramatic irony to the proceedings. Yet, as a standalone saga, House of the Dragon offers its own intrigue and character development that can captivate newcomers and series veterans alike. The world is still the world. Though the time period is different, the world of Westeros retains its identity. You've got your noble houses, your dragons, and the ever-present lust for power. The chessboard may host different kings and queens, but the game remains largely the same. Don't get me wrong, being a local in the vast map of Game of Thrones lore has its perks. But in the case of House of the Dragon, it's like moving to a new neighborhood in Portland, let's say from Beaverton to the Pearl District. While it helps to know the general layout, each area has its own culture and history to explore. Bottom line, just watch it. House of the Dragon is positioned more as a fresh start than additional chapters to an existing book. It offers a window into a time when dragons were abundant and Targaryens were at the height of their power, all without needing the full backstory of the family's eventual downfall. Consider it as an invitation to a feast where you don't need to know every guest's backstory to enjoy the sumptuous spread. You're there for the immediate drama, the pomp and the spectacle, the delicacies and the poison in the wine. So hop on that dragon, metaphorically speaking, unless Portland's got something wild I haven't heard about, and enjoy the ride. House of the Dragon is your chance to be part of the Game of Thrones craze, no extensive binge-watching required.